Learn to lead. We make winners who lead. Hello students, greetings from Learn to Lead Academy. How to score 600 plus in the upcoming Feb Mat 2024 examination? In this video, we are going to give you the preparation strategy for the next Feb Mat 2024 examination. Watch this video completely to know more about the upcoming Feb Mat 2024 examination. Now, as you all know, MAT exam is conducted by All India Management Association, we call it as IMA. And in MAT exams, we have five sections, language comprehension, mathematical skills, data analysis and sufficiency, intelligence and critical reasoning, Indian and global environment. So, from each section, you will get 40 questions. In total, you need to attend 200 questions in 150 minutes, that is two and a half hours. And the exam, you know, as you all know, it is held four times a year, the month of February, May, September and December. For the next academic year, if you want to do your MBA or PGDM in 2024, and this is the right time to write your MBA entrance examinations. And this MAT exam is to be held in the month of February, for which you can start your preparation now. And we, we at Learn to Lead Academy are providing Feb MAT online crash course for the MBA aspirants. This is the exam pattern. So as I told you, there are five sections, language comprehension, mathematical skills, data analysis and sufficiency, intelligence and critical reasoning, Indian and global environment. And in total, there are 200 questions. You need to attend those 200 questions in 150 minutes. That is your task. And the most important thing you have to focus is numerical ability, reasoning ability, verbal ability, grammar. See, under numerical ability, you should know, you should first start learning basic max concepts. Because in total, there are 80 questions based on arithmetic skills. So those 80 questions can be solved within the time only if you have a regular practice. So first get thorough with your basic max. So even though the calculator is allowed in the examination hall, that is system calculator is only allowed, your manual calculator is not allowed in the examination hall. So even though the calculator is allowed, but it is not sufficient, it will consume your time. So the best strategy is first work out on your basic mathematical skills like addition, subtraction, multiplication, finding out the square values, finding out the square roots, applying the divisibility rules, applying for cube roots. Okay, these basic calculations first you should get thorough before starting with your arithmetic skills topic. Only and the next thing after getting thorough with your basic mathematical part then come into the topic like pipes and system ages remensuration partnership probability venn diagram time and work percentage boats and streams and then time speed and distance trigonometry time based problems allegations and mixtures average permutation and combination algebra lcm and hcf simple interest and component interest so keep it in mind that from all the concepts you may expect two or three minimum two questions minimum one question you can expect maximum three to four questions you can expect under a single topic so just be thorough with your basic concepts of mathematics then only it will help you to crack mathematical skills as well as data interpretation questions within the time limit okay now What about intelligence and critical reasonings? So these are the topics you have to cover under intelligence and critical reasoning. The strategy which you need to follow for the next three months is first get thorough with your basic mathematics and daily allot one hour of time for your for developing your mathematical skills. And next, if you have one and of time, one and a half hours of time in the evening. What you can do is you can split one hour for mathematics and half an hour for other subjects, right? Intelligence and critical reasoning and English and verbal ability. Okay, if I if it is come to grammar, verbal ability, you should also get around the grammar. So it has to crack your error spotting part. 
Okay, reading comprehension, synonyms and antonyms. Choose the word. Meaning next to the underlined word. Fill in the blanks. One word substitution. Then these are the sum of the exercise. And also you should get thorough with the basic grammar part. That is very, very important. So first, a lot maximum number of hours for mathematics. Because only by practice, you can get a good score in the upcoming 600, uh, upcoming FEBMAT examination. So practice is very, very important in case of taking a competitive examination. I hope this video was uh, useful for you all. And also I have given you the topics, right? So the thing you have to follow is sit and study for study daily and give maximum number of hours for mathematics and the remaining I mean, half an hour to one hour for the other subjects. Definitely, it will help you to crack your or to boost your score in the FEBMAT examination. Okay. See, uh, are you looking for MAT 2024 Feb or May MAT exam preparation? You can join our online live class, right? And if you want to enroll for this online live class, you can enroll directly to 8870046080. Okay. I hope you all got some information regarding the MAT 2024 examination. And also, we are going to start a new batch for TANSET 2024 MBA and MCA students from December 25th. So, let me... Learn to lead. We make winners who lead.